So I'm Nengi Omukuru. I'm a painter from uh, Lagos, Nigeria, and I, I live and I, I work in Lagos. I fell in love with art when I was 11. And so I did a bachelor's and, an, and, and a master's at the Slade School of Fine Arts. And then I came back to Nigeria in 2012 and I've been practicing since then. In Nigeria, I'd been doing a lot of research into textiles. And um, at first of all, just as a way, because I fell in love with textiles in Nigeria and I wanted to know a bit more about what was traditional and what was authentically Nigerian, like from the different parts of Nigeria. And that's how I came across uh, Sonyos, which is a fabric I work with. And it's a pre-colonial textile from Western Nigeria, uh, made of uh, silk that came from moths from the north of Nigeria. And it was mixed with industrial cotton in Western Nigeria to make these beautiful fabrics. And unfortunately, we don't make them again in this specific kind of way with local cotton and local wild silk. But I found out that in Dakar, that there were people that were revitalizing the textile industry. And so I decided to um, apply for this residency and luckily I got in and it's been incredible because I have met these um, heroes of, of mine firsthand, um, Aisa Dion and Fale Fatim. And I, I've had the opportunity to go to both their workshops and just really like sit and learn from them. And it was just inspiring spending the day with them, learning how to spin thread. I realized it's very difficult and it was just an absolute uh, dream come true just to see like the possibilities and to see that this is something that can be revitalized even in Nigeria. So at first when I, in the sleigh they told us to be very um, aware of surfaces and materials, methods and materials. And that's sort of where the whole energy and the whole interest in surfaces started for me. Um, so I was very particular about whatever surface I worked on, even when I was a student, I'm very broke and couldn't really afford <laughs> nice things. Um, I was very particular about my surfaces and always went for the highest quality. So most, on most occasions I would work with linen and linen just had a completely different energy and feel to painting on canvas. Or I would work with paper or work with wood and sand it to a very fine sort of like surface because there is something about the engagement with the surface, that's the primary thing a painting is about, like how the brush touches the surface before any idea of image making or anything. It's about mark making on a specific surface. So when I moved to Nigeria, I was struggling to find high quality linen and cotton until I was introduced to Sonia. And that's when I realized that this fabric is centuries old. It has stood the test of time for this whole period and it is still existing and it's going out of fashion. And there was just this aha moment. I don't know how to explain it. It was like when I met the fabric, it almost felt like a spiritual connection. And immediately I felt I, there's no longer any need to describe the material in my paintings, that I can collaborate with the textile and begin to make paintings that are both about the history of weaving in Nigeria, as well as about my contemporary experience. So that's where it came from. I think even me working with this surface is, is a bit of like, it's, it's sort of like nostalgia in, in a way. It's like dreaming of the good old days <laughs> that I didn't get to experience, but maybe uh, like, you know, a time at which Nigeria was better. I think it's, it's, it's me even working with this surface is almost as a, in a way, it's like, a, it's like longing for the regeneration of like um, creativity in this kind of way, um, innovation, like thinking about how to create thread from silk, from moths and, you know, spinning our own cotton. So it's, it's a longing for a coming back of those days. In a residency, the only way to have a successful residency is complete things. But this whole residency has sort of shifted the way in which I think about spending time in a new place in the sense that like, conversations can ignite things in the future or meetings can like take you off in a new direction. So yeah, it's the best residency I've ever experienced, definitely. 